everybody. Hello. It's Gail the Happy Stamper. Thanks for joining me today. And I just wanted to show you a tag that I made. Um, I've been so excited. I went to Michael's today and I picked up the perfect pearls. And um, so I was just itching to play with those today. And um, I like it. I'm going to have to keep working on it. Not, oh, and I almost forgot. Somebody had, hang on. Oh, tell me it's not broken. Um, there it goes. Oh, someone had a really blingy ring on. I think it was Arlene or someone. Anyways, it was fabulous. So we were out with the family and the kids bowling Saturday night, and I got a ring from the uh, gumball machine and took me like two packs of Skittles to get it out of the little girl's hands. Um, but I'm just kidding anyways. But I did have to pay her two things of Skittles. So anyways, um, just wanted to show you I got this new stamp today. I had seen it at Michael's. It was on sale. Plus for my birthday, for your month, um, I had a 20% off coupon from... Uh, Joanne, so they honored it there. Um, but I just wanted to show you this tag that I made, and this is actually um, one of the corks from a bottle of wine. We had some friends over last weekend, and um, I've been super excited to try to play with all these things. So I used my shipping tags that I get at, um, you know, where did I get them? Staples. And what I did was I used my alcohol inks, my Anirondac inks, and I did gold, what color was this one, copper, and then I had a pearl, and I just stamped on that. So I have kind of a pretty golden, um, oh goodness, it, it just it looks kind of worn. And then, of course, I just, you know, went around the edges with my... Um, distressing tool, which I love. Love it. And um, I heat embossed my beautiful girl here, and then I used my perfect pearls. I don't know if you're going to be able to tell, but she's very gold and shiny and, um, you know, looks like something got spilled on it. So, anyways, I did that with the... Um, Gold Perfect Pearls after I embossed. And it comes with two brushes and then this handy dandy thing that you can just whoo, like that. And so I did that and distressed it. As I said, I just put some fibers on the top. But I did heat uh, with my Dremel. This is like the most awesome um, glue gun. I got it from Martha Stewart. I mean, I got it from Martha Stewart. I went to her show last spring, um, and she was giving those out to everybody in the audience. So, um, anyways, I just also added a Tim Holtz down in the corner here, one of these cute little clips. And this little tag says Journey 2167. And uh, I just hot glue gunned my cute little... Um, cork from our wine. So I just wanted to share that. I'm super excited about having all these really cool um, tags to be making. And I just love this. I'm thinking I might do a set of like my favorite things or something like that. But this was using this really cool stamp. I know Janie and a bunch of girls have it. Um, but I just wanted to do that, and I've been saving my wine bottles, so I just wanted to incorporate that somehow. I'm going to try to figure out how I can dangle it maybe from some kind of a charm. Oh, there, now you can see it. Can you see all the glitter? What did I do? Yeah, it's pretty cool, I have to say. That Perlex is really amazing. Um, and I just distressed it a little bit with some worn lipstick, the tea dye, um, and the vintage photo. But it's kind of cool because it's black in one angle, and then you turn it and it looks gold. Kind of cool, ladies and gentlemen. Also, 
big sale. Primas um, were, I think, $3. They only had selected colors. I got the green because I love the green. But that was on sale today. So that's what I did when I got home from my grocery shopping today. Again, that was using this really cool stamp. And look at my funky bling. Woo! Rock on. That's so cute. Okay, it's a shamrock, but whatever. Anyways, guys, I hope you're having a great day. Thanks for checking in with the Happy Stamper. I hope to talk to you guys soon. All right, have a great day. Bye.